He knows this isn't a boxing ring, right? He just wants one round. One round? One round. This mustn't register on an emotional level. First, discombobulate. Dazed, discombobulate. Distract target. Discombobulate. Block his blind jab. Discombobulate. He'll attempt wild haymaker. Discombobulate. In summary, discombobulate. Hello. Hey, what's up? I need your help. Can you come here? I can't. I'm buying clothes. All right. Well, hurry up and come over here. I can't find them. What do you mean you can't find them? I can't find them. There's only soup. What do you mean there's only soup? It means there's only soup. Well, then get out of the soup aisle. All right. You don't have to shout at me. There's more soup. What do you mean there's more soup? There's just more soup! Go into the next aisle! There's still soup! Where are you right now? I'm at soup! What do you mean you're at soup? I mean I'm at soup! What store are you in? I'm at the soup store! Why are you buying clothes at the soup store? Fuck yeah! Having just finished my intense training next door, craving a snack, I found myself at the pinnacle of human civilization. Walmart. Hey, I know that place! I've been there. As I was browsing the aisles, I noticed a woman looking at me with admiration. She must have sensed my power. Pretty sure she had a question. Or she wanted to witness my overwhelming strength. Or maybe she was struck by your charming personality. I then approached and asked her if she'd like to witness my true power. She said I'd love to see what you're capable of. Ahaha, <laughs> my man, what next? I yelled, prepare yourself, and I unleashed my ultimate attack right there in the middle of aisle 10. A massive shockwave erupted, destroying the entire store. No one survived. Yeah, sounds like a classic Walmart experience to me. I think you're missing the point, Jiren. She was there for you, not your power. Oh. Really? Yeah, you were getting hit on. I had no idea. At this point, just change your name to Jiren the Dumbass. Nice form. Thank you. Chicken is cute! It offends me. Fight me! So, tiny chicken, you accept my challenge. Conveniently placed pile of explosives. Good move. You win this time. So, this is the place, huh? Seems like it. Hey. Wait a minute. Are those... Kermit! Huh? I said no One Piece characters allowed for the barbecue. Hey, don't look at me. I put up a sign. That's close enough, pirate. You both know that One Piece fans are not welcome here. That's exactly why we're here. Also for the barbecue. Excuse me? I heard you have a problem. And Rips, I'm here for both. That is actually kind of gangster, I'm not gonna lie. Shut the fuck up, Kermit. You're supposed to be on my side. I am on your side. Hey, 
Wait a minute. Aren't you the frog that shot me? Mm, nope. Nope, that didn't happen. Yes, it did. I remember you clearly shooting me in the back. No, I don't think so. If he shot you, then how are you alive? I made of rubber? Duh. Bullets don't work on... Hey! What the fuck? You were gonna shoot me again, weren't you? Please, that's ridiculous. Yes. Stop, stop! Hold on, it was a joke. It was a joke! <laughs> All right, that's enough. I doubt that any of you can destroy planets, so unless you want to sail the depths of space, I suggest you all leave. Give me one day, and I'll make you a One Piece fan. What? One day! <laughs> Challenge accepted. So? Okay, it's not that bad. You fucking traitor! <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe you dragged me all the way out to fucking Namek for this bullshit! Undo your wish, now! Alright, whatever. I wish Shallot was not vegan. Your wish has been granted. State your next wish. We get more than one wish? Oh, oh, can I get this one? Uh, I wish we were in the Kitchen Pain universe! Wait, Yay! wait, come and wait! <laughs> Has been granted. State your last wish. Oh my god, what happened to my thickness? Cell, we're in the kitchen verse. Come on, man, you know better. We're 2D animated. Ha <laughs> 2D! You ruined it, Shallot. Why did you make this wish? Um, because of the fan service in this universe? Hello? What the? What is she even doing here? God damn it, why are all the women from this universe always trying to kill us, Kermit? You know, I haven't figured that out yet, but I hear it's a hell of a way to go. Can we please undo this last wish? Fight me! You can't be fucking serious! Oh, he's adorable. It doesn't matter the time, place, or universe, I will not fight you! Hermit, the big-breasted Antag is ominously approaching. Okay, okay. Parunga, can you please take us back to the DAU? <laughs> what? What the? What? Where's the big boob lady? We're back in the DAU, Cell. Thank God. You saved me from simping. For now, Cell. For now. <laughs> Great, now the video's sus. Shut the fuck up, I haven't had meat in a month! Goku? Foolish woman, I am not Son Goku. I am black. Goku, I support a lot of your shenanigans, but I can't back this one. We both know you're not black. No, no, I, I'm black. No, no you are not. I am black. Am I black? You could be. Fuck yeah. Goten, you are not dismissed. Woman, let the boy be. Woman? What's gotten into you, Goku? Did you hit your head again? For the last time, I'm not Goku. I am black. Well, that took you long enough. The wife was cooking. Here, try some of this. You can't be serious. Just take a bite. 
Um, oh. Oh, in the name of the gods. This is divine. Isn't it? It's called rice. Fuck me. Hey. Oh, you know what I mean. Oh. Hi ho! <laughs> welcome, welcome, Link, right? Can I interest you in more weapons of mass destruction? Hey! Uh, come again? Ha! Did you get that, Melvin? Ha! Yeah, me either. One more time? Ha! It's the accent for me, I'm sorry. Ha! Oh, I see. You're looking for a heap of items, huh? Well, how about these Kakori nuts? These ones specifically, right here. Perfect for any aspiring hero. What do you say? All right, all right. I know what you're here for then. The good shit. Just a second. It's down here somewhere. Aha, found it. A look no further, homie. Behold. <laughs> Pleasure doing business with you, Link. Don't ask me why it's sticky. Big fan, by the way. Love the green. I don't see it. It's just an opinion. There's no way this guy is cooler than me. I mean, it's debatable. He's wearing green tights. So? What's wrong with green? Well, I nothing's wrong with green. It's just not as cool as purple. Purple is for pussies. Say that to my face. Purple is for pussies. I... He... This is bullshit! Name one thing he has that makes him cooler than me. Lion tattoo. Oh, that's respectable at best. I can destroy planets. Well, I mean, he has a boomerang axe. That's pretty cool. Who gives a shit about a boomerang axe when you can hold the power of the sun in your hands? Oof. Yeah. It is awkward. What's up? Okay, that's completely unoriginal! I am the guy who launches suns at people! Who decided that? What? What is that? Is that music? He has his own theme song and catchphrase? Oh, gee, he's cool. But... I'm... <laughs> I'm the, I'm the coolest in the universe. <laughs> All right, no one move. This is a sticker. I want the teller to put the money in this here bag. Kermit, what the hell are you doing? What am I doing? What are you doing? I work here. You have a job? I do. Oh, well, I'm robbing you. Yeah, I can see that. Can you possibly come back and do that on a day off? No. Kermit the f man. Screw that. Sesame Street has my ass claiming bankruptcy cell. Now put that money in this here mother bag or else. There comes a time in a Muppet's life where he has to take a step back and realize that- Is this gonna take any longer? <laughs> I'm sorry, Cell. That was rude. Go on. Right. Thanks. They have to take a step back and realize that- Oh, uh, uh, you shot me. You monster- Take a step back and- uh, Oh god! Oh god! Is he fucking done? I think he is, so. Yeah. Take a step back and realize that your actions have consequences. You can rob this bank, or you can walk away a free man. Cell? So? Yes. I'm a Muppet. Now put the money in the fucking bag! God damn it! Fine! Kermit, why is there a random mutt in the middle of my ring? I was watching him for a client. He should be here soon, actually. Why is he doing that? What? Reading? Cause it's a smart dog cell? Kermit, it's standing on two fucking legs. Don't you find that at least a little bit suspicious? Is that the British National Anthem? Ooh! Whoops! You okay, lad? Nothing broken, I trust? It's all good, pal. He can handle it. You both. Over here, Gromit. Mind your step, Gromit. Wonder if we'll get back in time for tea. I'd love a spot of cheese right now. Ho ho ho! Oh, that'll do nicely. Mmm, cheese. 
Yeah, I don't mean to interrupt the whole weird cheese fetish thing you got going on, but I still need to be paid. Nothing to worry about. Oh, it was a pleasure, my friend. You have a very smart dog. Yeah, I've had an idea. Sure, sure, monkey impression. Good work, Gromit. Time to make a move, lad. Yeah, 99% sure that was racist. Guy pays well, though. And I'm not a fruitcake, am I, lad? Where in the God's name are we? I think this might be Disney World. The DAU has a Disney World. Pretty sure every multiverse has a Disney World. And why are we here? What do you mean, why are we here? It's Disney. Gods don't go to Disney. Says who? Says us. Look, if we're gonna destroy everything, we might as well enjoy it before we do. <laughs> Lay there, gentlemen! Is that goofy? It is. <laughs> Was that really necessary? Is that hat on your head necessary? Would you like one? It looks ridiculous. Would you like one? Yes. You know what? I changed my mind. We should do this more often. <laughs> Mercy. Fool. Well then, where to next? Hmm. Super Nintendo World? Super Nintendo World. Subarashi. What? This place. It's magnificent. An entire universe based on a video game. Hmm. It seems mortals have indeed discovered a way to entertain themselves. Amazing. Look at these hats. We are gods. We don't need hats. What if it pleases you? Go ahead. Check it out. <laughs> it's a me, Goku Black. Let's a go. Bro, what the fuck? Can you refrain from causing chaos for five minutes so we can find the restroom, please? What? Where have you gone? Over here! I'm going to show these Ningans the true power of a god in a go-kart. Oh, I'm just trembling with anticipation. <laughs> On second thought, I don't actually know how to drive. Where did you get that? This? The mortal's handing them out over there. Is he speaking Spanish? Evening, gentlemen. Sorry to intrude. Would either of you like some hot towels? Oh, yes, please. No, thank you. Oh, come on, Wesker. This shit feels amazing. Try it. Refreshing. A legendary number one hit band. It's promises power. Omnipotence. Immortality. But at what cost? One that is greater than any man can imagine, and heavier than any man can bear. No soul who has ever worn its tattered grace has ever escaped the torment. Yeah, that's cool and all, but who the fuck is this guy? Have you not seen Afro Samurai? Who in the hell is Afro Samurai? He's a samurai! With an afro. Is that rap music? It follows him everywhere he goes. What does he want? He is but a wanderer, wearing the number two headband, seeking revenge against the man wearing the number one. Revenge for what? Number one killed his dad. Of course. Typical pro tag. A legendary number one headband. Oh god, he's starting again. Okay! Thank you, Mr. Samurai! Good luck with your revenge. Have a nice day. I will murder you! Careful, Cell. That could be considered a hate crime. Kermit, that's not funny. 
Well, I don't know how to tell you this, but uh, neither are you, so. Ah! Well, you're gonna pass that shit or what? Hey, can I get a hit? Ah! Shall we finish destroying the rest of the castle? What are you doing? Come again. Why are you doing that? What? The pillaging? No, not the pillaging. Your voice. I don't follow. You're fucking British! Okay, tea is a beverage enjoyed across multiple universes. Oh my god, I'm not talking about your stupid cup of tea. I'm talking about your voice. You went from a chain-smoking sociopath to a terrible, terrible impression of a well-mannered British man. I say... Damn it, we don't talk that way! Well, excuse me for trying to give off more elegance. Yeah, I wouldn't say elegance, but the pink hair is giving Major Karen energy. Can we please focus on the pillaging? I'm just saying... It's very distracting. <laughs> Check it out! I'm a janitor. <coughs> Inquisitor. Yeah. I bet 50 credits that he'll end up dead by the end of this. Make it 100 and you're on. Morning. Morning. What are you doing? Making pancakes. 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 Can I have some? No. What? Why? Because I only have one plate. So let's share. No. That's totally gay. What are you, five? Hungry, actually. Okay, can you just, I don't know, toss me one? They're ripping hot off the pan. Please. A mere pancake could never harm a girl. Oh! You know, it tastes way better with syrup. You should try the blueberry. Absolutely divine. Look, it's just... It's not gonna work out. Okay, how about the Cell Max games? Yeah, that sounds stupid. But if I do it, I can make my own videos, just like you. You know, that's not a bad idea, Cell. Having a side hustle can be profitable. What do you know about side hustles? Nah, sometimes I do voice work on the side. What, like voice acting? Audiobooks, actually. Women's erotic novels. And so, he gently brushed his ball sack across my lips ever so slightly slapping my nose. It pays the bills. What if I create versus videos? Absolutely not. Come on, sell Max versus Ugandan Knuckles. I swear to God, if you do that, I will kill myself again. What about sell versus sell Max? Oh no, no, the sell versus sell thing is reserved for Taka, okay? You, you need to be original. But you're not original. You're a parody of Team Four Star. <laughs> He needs to be more original! I got it! I'll get myself a sidekick. Specifically, a Muppet. What? Hold on. Is that foreshadowing? Max? Motherfucker, is that foreshadowing? Max? Max! Uh, another day of serving divine justice. How did you sleep, Teddy Black? Hmm. Hey, Teddy. This world and its filthy ningen always <laughs> require maintenance. It's our job to eliminate them all. What? No, that's not a racial slur. Ah, you made it just how I like it, Teddy. Black. Ugh. All right, Teddy, I'm off to serve true justice. I'll see you tonight for D&D. Go forth, my dark master. Right. No more coffee before destroying the same. What is it? I'm hungry. We've been plotting the destruction of the mortals all day. Can I please read my book? I hunger. Must you give in to such mortal desires? Food. 
Very well, we'll order a pizza. Now we're talking. A symbolic act. First we shall consume their food, then their very existence. It's poetic, really. Always the philosopher. Hello, Capsule Corp Pizzeria. How can I help you? Yes, good evening. I'd like to place an order for a large pizza with the essence of mortal suffering. Uh, we, we, we have pepperoni. Divine. That will do. Oh, and tell them to add green peppers. We love green peppers. Indeed. Add green peppers. The colors of divine justice. Uh, okay, so a large pepperoni and green pepper pizza. Uh, anything else? Yes, actually. Please make sure that it's delivered by a mortal. We have... plans. Are you coming on to me? What? No. Failure to deliver this pizza in your appetite 30 minutes or less will result in... Uh... A, a rather scathing review. All right, buddy, all right. No need for the aggression, okay? You'll get your pizza. All right, the 30 minutes. Tops. See? Easy. Now, can I please finish my book? He dies in the end. Oh, you divine c Sal! Where the hell is he? Well, well! If it isn't the great one! I... I don't know you. You're the green guy who hurt my friend! I'm sorry. Uh, your friend? <laughs> Ow! What the hell? I don't even know who you're talking about! Tell me! Do you know the Muffin Man? The Muffin Man? The Muffin Man! Uh, yeah. Yeah, I know the Muffin Man. The one who lives on Drury Lane with all the bitches. He's friends with the Muffin Man! The Muffin Man? The Muffin Man! Dude, what the fuck are we even talking about at this point? Die, you green bastard! Hey, Sal. There you are. You know, I'd ask what's going on, but at this point, I'm not surprised. He's blaming me for hurting one of his friends. I have no idea who he's talking about. A donkey fellow! Four legs! Annoying voice! Oh, I remember him. Yeah, to be fair, you all have annoying voices. <laughs> Ow! Hey! Kermit wasn't the one who attacked your donkey. It was I. You! So then, you have chosen death! Yeah, knock yourself out. Die! Die, you monster! <sighs> Kermit, can I please? Don't, Sal. Just... just let him have his revenge, man. Die, you son of a bitch! Die! <sighs> Fine. So... you guys can't do any ninjutsu? Please, who needs ninjutsu? Taijutsu is superior! Okay, guys, say that when you have to block this Rasengan with your foot, and it blows up. Is that supposed to scare me? Actually, it's supposed to handicap you. Me? Handicapped? That'll be the day. Can you believe this, Lee? This guy throws up a bunch of gang signs for some fancy ninjutsu and suddenly he's the protagonist. Ninjutsu is indeed impressive, but taijutsu takes real skill, perseverance, determination, and- And Lou. Fucking what? Don't look at me like that. You wouldn't know the first thing about being a real ninja. I know it doesn't include Lou. Hey, Lee, blink twice if you need help. You want to see some ninjutsu? I'll give you some ninjutsu. Drown a bitch no jutsu! What the fuck was that? Salt water. I don't get it. Is that supposed to- I'm in a drive through a Burger King. Can I please get a Wobble Jr. wear on your rings? Make it a meal so I can get a drink. No, I'm not finished, that's not everything Can I please get a double waffle with no cheese? Can I please get a number two with a large drink? I got money so I don't care how much it costs me So just throw in some extra fries, don't make them salty All the cheese gonna make my booty drip drip Today you cry like baby Fight me! Fight me! Fight me! Fight me!
Son of bitch! Fucking fight me! Fight me! Coward! I'm back. Yeah, I fucking noticed. Good news, I got myself a sidekick. Hi, how are you? Now, I can make my own videos, just like you. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's not a Muppet. What? You frog thing. It's not a Muppet, it doesn't count. What do you mean it doesn't count? It doesn't count! He's a frog. And he's hideous. It'll scare away the subs. Feels bad, man. <laughs> you take that back. Eat shit, you oversaturated roach. <laughs> oh, great. What the hell is he doing? I think you offended him, so. Big deal. I'm perfect. Yeah, I should probably mention that Max is stronger than you. Quite like a lot. Oh, that would have been great to know in the first episode! I mean, we can't call back up. That's a great idea. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Oh, yeah. Thanks, Gohan. Charlotte! I meant Charlotte, you fuck! Man, quite the place, huh, Pepe? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, sure is something. So, Pepe, is this where you intend to do it? You know? It's rather obvious. You brought me out here away from prying eyes, and you've cornered me to this cliffside. I'm the one who deserves this life, not you. So what? You're gonna kill me now? didn't have to go this way, you know. I know. But you chose this anyway. You're no slouch, Kermit. But time hasn't been kind to you. With the Darksaber, I am invincible. And no matter how skilled you may believe yourself to be, age always catches up. Eventually, you're gonna make a mistake. Funny, you made one first. What? Farewell, Pepe. Kermit, why are we out here? We need to take safety precautions, Cell. I can't have the arena be destroyed by your next opponent. My next opponent? Behold! The adorable Kirby! Kermit, that is not Kirby. Mm, that's Kirby, Cell. That is not Kirby. That is most definitely 100% Kirby, Cell. Kermit, you're pulling some bullshit again. I know that is not Kirby. Fire! See? He speaks Spanish. Enjoy your fight, Cell. Hey! Hey! Kermit! I didn't agree to fight this... Whatever the fuck this is! Fire! Shut up. I'm not talking to you. Actually, Cell, you were right. I made a mistake. It's not Kermit. Cell? Cell! Boy, yo. Huh. That's cursed. So, he's a what now? An X-Men. You know, one of those superheroes. Sorta. Of. Yeah, no. Yeah, you might need to do more than that, so. What? 
Is that all you got, bub? The fuck? Is he a mortal? Healing factor, actually. That's fucking hacks. You can do the same thing. Yeah, but he's wearing tights and is emotionally unstable. Why the hell give someone like that a healing factor? You're naked and you're emotionally unstable. I'm pretty sure that's worse. Okay, you make a fair point, but allow me to retort. I'm listening. Fuck you! Ha! <laughs> Dead. I'm very much alive. Fuck! Told you. Is he unkillable? No, more like super, super, super hard to kill. How do you know so much about this guy? I read the comics. I know everything about this guy. Everything? Everything. The blow-up dolls in my closet are for research. The fucking what? Why can't we just throw the party at Sales Place? Because bad things always happen at Sales Place? I'd rather throw the party here, where it's safe. It's literally thousands of miles out at sea. Come on, I'll give you a set of, uh, two Dragon Balls. What the fuck am I supposed to do with two Dragon Balls? I don't know. You can collect four more and then wish for people to actually like you. What, did you drop out of preschool? What? And for the record, people love me. Way more than you, in fact. Bullshit. What do you have that I don't? Turtle Riz. That's not even a thing. Oh, it is definitely a thing. Show him, Turtle! That doesn't count. He doesn't count. What can I say? He's got the shell. Bitches love shells. What could you possibly know about what a woman wants? You live alone. Nonsense. I was young once, and I was a legend. I went by many names. The Coochie Hermit. The Snatch President. My personal favorite, the Beaver Whisperer. You made those up. I did not. Well, if you have Turtle Riz, then I have Monkey Riz. I'm pretty sure that's racist. How is that racist? I'm the saying here. Oh, I know what you're saying here, and it's racist. Show some respect. I have students who are minorities, goddammit. You're a crazy old man. The connoisseur of Kuche is also an acceptable name. Right. I'm leaving. Hold on. Don't forget your balls. <laughs> oh, shut up. We gotta go. We gotta go. <laughs> Get out of my way! It's time for me to shine! A booler! Two boolers! Boolers? Booler! Frieza! Shut up! There's no time! The servers are dying! I feel like you gotta cover your mouth when you talk as cooler. <laughs> oh, it's me! Cooler, it's me! It's my back. Oh, oh, are we doing this? Who the fuck is this guy? Damn! <laughs> <laughs> I thought I could hang out, but I guess not. I'm losing. <laughs> <laughs> that was, that was kind of rude, Dion. I'm not gonna lie. He just wanted to hang out with us. <laughs> Damn! I just, just wanted to chill. Absolutely fucked up behavior, bro. He was sitting in my seat. <laughs> it was so warm. I was very comfy. <laughs> when a new kid would come to Dion's class, he would just sit there and yell at him for like the first ten minutes of class. <laughs> Don't you know this is my seat, dude? <laughs> like all, all of these chairs? Yup. Damn. <laughs> all my ass warmth.
Yeah! <laughs> oh man, you are the hidden challenger? You had the cojones to show up and face the mighty Hercule! <laughs> you had more guts than I thought! Yeah, if I had known it was you, I'd have stayed home. Well, don't you worry. I'll end it quick. <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> no, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Just had a little slip there. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> That's what I'm talking about! <laughs> a solid sidestep! I didn't move. Well, now it's time for a counterattack! <laughs> Hercule Punch! <laughs> Can you please take this seriously? Fine. If you want me to take this serious, let's get serious. You could call me Super Hercule. I fucking love it. Super Hercule Punch! Hey, you hit the wall. That means I win, right? Okie dokie, see you soon, Henry. Hey, Kermit. Have you seen my dad? Ah, uh, no! Can't say I have. Um, why are you... What? Taking a shit? Thick. Hey, yo! No, literally. Why... Why are you so bulky? What? Have you never seen my super form? I mean, should I have? Kid, this is only like 50% of my power. <laughs> Feast your eyes on the thickest in the universe. Okay, is the posing necessary? Yes, absolutely. Is that a tattoo on your ass? It is. Don't ask. I was young once. How old are you? Why are you looking for your dad, Junior? I need emotional support. Ha ha ha! Ah, no, seriously. Oh, you're serious. Well, unfortunately, he's the one who needs emotional support right now. He's dealing with a loss at the moment. You piece of shit. This was all a part of your goddamn plan. Well, I won't let you win! You hear me, you son of a bitch! This is not over! Shouldn't we just get the Dragon Balls and revive the thing? Yeah, I kind of already told Cell it wouldn't work. So you lied? There's a possibility that this statement is 100% correct. Besides, there's no rush. We have plenty to enjoy. Like my abs. Bruh. Seriously, look at them! You can grate cheese on these motherfuckers! Dear Mario, please come to the castle. I have baked a cake for you. Yours truly, Princess Toadstool. Peach. Let's 
to go. Mia! <laughs> Dear Mario, please come to the castle. I have baked a cake for you. Yours truly, Princess Toadstool. <laughs> Thank you, Mario. We have to do something special for you. Listen, everybody. Let's bake a delicious cake for Mario. Thank you so much for playing my game. Roshi? Roshi! I mean, it, it was ridiculous. You should have seen what happened after the music stopped. Thank God the cameras weren't rolling, because, man, we would have been demonetized. Still nice, though. Yeah, now this is what I'm talking about, boys. This is a hot spring. Roshi, why can't you wait your turn like a normal person? Oh, I'm sorry. I don't see a sign that says private bath. It's on the goddamn wall. You're just, you're fucking blind. Kermit, I promise, I'll keep my hands to myself. Mostly. You said that last time. For reals is this time. Roshi, I'm trying to relax with a friend. Do you mind? I don't, actually. What's up, baby? Are you not wearing any pants? Perhaps. Why are you like this? Wrinkled? It gets worse in the water, I'm sorry. But no, Roshi. Who's your friend? Uh, she's my date? Can we get some privacy? All right, all right. You can have your privacy. So then, give us some privacy? Do you not see the hands? I'm blind. You could touch my wet, wrinkled body right now, and I wouldn't know who it is. <laughs> yeah, give me a minute, Tsunade. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Damn, baby, you into choking? <laughs> so, you finally arrived, Pharaoh. Kaiba, what is the meaning of this? I had my men escort you to this facility, so that we may finally settle our score, Yugi. Hey, couldn't you just send me a text? A what? A text? On my phone. <laughs> Poor people. A duelist of my caliber and financial income wouldn't bother stooping to the commoner's way of communication. Did you just call me poor? Enough stalling, Yugi. Prepare yourself. Very well, Kaiba. It... Where's the duel disc? Please, duel discs are a poor person's dueling tools, Yugi. You're the one who invented the damn thing. Welcome to the 21st century, Pharaoh. We'll be dueling using my new Augmented Reality Stadium! Here, the monsters are as close to being alive as physically possible. You know, I would have settled for a table and some cards, right? What? All this. The flashy ring, the virtual monsters, just seems needlessly complicated. Exactly what a poor person would say. I'm sorry, is there something you want to say to me? What was that? I just couldn't hear you. I feel like you have something to say. Enough stalling, Yugi! It's time to duel! 
You won't be needing physical cards. I've taken the liberty of virtually copying your deck. Quite impressive, Kaiba. Indeed, Yugi. It's amazing what you can do when you're not fucking poor! Oh, wow! First, I draw. Then, I summon the Blue Eyes White Dra- Hey, what the hell are you doing? You can't just walk up in the middle of a duel- Daddy! All right, I accept your challenge. On the condition that we keep the budget to a minimum. I just paid for League of Memes. Agree. Perfect. It's time to duel. I draw. First, I summon the ominous snowman. Dude, why are you yelling? I am right in front of you. <clears throat> he has an attack of 2100. Then, I set one card face down, and I end my turn. Good. I draw. Then, I play Pot of Greed! This card allows me to- I know what Pot of Greed does. Oh, excuse me, fucking know-it-all. I draw two cards, I set three, and I end my turn. <laughs> A wasted effort. It ends here. I draw! First, I activate my snowman special effect, which allows me to special summon a snow token! What are you doing? I don't have a token, so we're using this instead. That's a fucking banana! Then, I sacrifice my ominous snowman and the banana to special summon the Blue Eyes White Dragon! <laughs> What the fuck are you doing? I... I summoned the Blue Eyes White Dragon. I'm making the sound effect with my mouth. Okay, look, can we just... Can we play the fucking game? We don't need sound effects, or fancy holograms, or banana tokens. It's a children's card game! Can I at least shout when I attack? I am sitting three feet away from you. Blue Eyes White Dragon! White Lightning! <laughs> ah! Mirror Force. Is this what I deserve? Eternal suffering day in, day out? It's not that bad, Cell. We have a new Tenkaichi game on the way. That's true. That's true. Who the hell needs a new Tenkaichi when you have the mighty shoe? <laughs> Jesus Christ, is that the Ninja Fox? Oh, you thought you'd seen the last of me? Think again, pal! The mighty shoe has returned! And this time, I have my hot-ass assistant Mai with me. Alright, one, she's mid. And two, I'm pretty sure you guys are the assistants. Yeah, we know sidekicks when we see them, buddy. Come on, where's your leader? Burning in hell with the rest of the vegans! And soon, you will be too. Okay, but we're not vegan. I know vegans when I see them, buddy. You should try shallot instead. What'd I say? He's already trying to get me to taste his vegan schlop. Do you think he'll taste like chicken? What? I don't know, Cell. Maybe more like deer, perhaps. What the? What are you, what are you saying? You're a frog. We need to leave. Well, we need to leave like now. Why the uh, rush, you? What the fuck? Stay a while. Whoa! Whoa, 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 hold on, pal! Please, Shu, take a seat next to this conveniently placed pot of chicken broth. Oh, you fuckers are sick! You're trying to eat me! Oh no, Shu. See, if I was trying to eat you, I'd shove you in my ass. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ! So, sup, baby? You know what else this Muppet eats? Kermit! What? Alright boys, time for an update! Kowalski, analysis! We've commandeered the vessel, Skipper. The captain has surrendered to us. I'm not the captain. That's not what I like to hear. Kowalski, shut him up! <laughs> Private status report! I found the devil fruit, Skipper! Rabbit, it's not a devil fruit, it's a goddamn tangerine! Why are you looking for a devil fruit? That is classified! We're creating the ultimate monster! Damn it, Private! Now we have to kill him! I think I've heard enough.
Hold on now, what are you doing? You're tied up and you're outnumbered. Actually, I cut myself free five minutes ago. And that devil fruit? It's right here. Hey, he has the devil fruit! If you want this fruit, you'll have to take it from me. Fine then, we'll do things your way. Rico! <laughs> Three sword style secret technique. Three thousand <laughs> Skipper. Ah. <laughs> this is perfect. Oh, my. Zabon! Nice tub! Do you mind if I join? Yes, I mind! Have you heard of privacy? Well, this isn't exactly a private spa cell. You're out and exposed in the elements. It's symbolic. It's called asserting your dominance. By taking a bath. This is my arena, Zabon. I can do what I want. Mm. Does that include giving everyone a free show? I... That's not the point! Do you even use soap? Of course I use soap. I have standards. Standards? With a rubber ducky? It's for ambience. Who the fuck are you, the bat police? What's with the interrogation? Oh, I'm just curious. It's not every day you get to see a bioengineered monster taking a bath. It's just a normal bath, Zabon. If it's so interesting, just go take one yourself. Ooh, maybe I will. Scoot over. <laughs> Wait, what? Mm, you're right. This is nice. Do me a favor, Sam. Get my ass, will you? Not bad, not bad. But still nothing compared to these babies. The chrome is kinda tacky, don't you think? This is the way. Well, hey now, don't you talk to me about no fucking way here, alright? Wherever it is that you are from, I do not know the way. Alright, Tell, relax, relax. Hey, try not to mention that stuff. He has PTSD. Ah, it's adorable. Ah! Yep. Yep, he's a Jedi. This is the way. What does that even mean? Kermit, what is it? I believe he is the same species as Master Yoda, so. He's probably like 50, lives with his dad, and is a total virgin. Is that a fucking hot dog? With mustard, yes. Wanna bite? All right, enough of this. I am tired of dealing with you goddamn Star Trek characters. Star Wars, Cell. Whatever, it's the same thing. Uh, are you fucking blind? It's really not. Okay then, Kermit. Star Wars, can I continue? Are you sure you don't want to bite on my Get your fucking hey! meat out of my face! <laughs> Did you have to slap it so hard? <laughs> After I kill these two, you and your sausage are next. <laughs> oh, you fucking bitch. This is the way. Oh, come on, man! I'm innocent! Well, well, if it isn't the frog. No way. Never expected to see you here. I guess that makes us sailmates. <laughs> you see what I did there? What are you in for? Tax evasion. So they got you too, huh? Well, tell you what. If you can help me break out of here, we can get you back to your bug man and me back to my team. What do you say? Okay, why would I work with you? Didn't you try and kill us? Multiple times, yes. And now you just want us to temporarily work with each other to bust out of prison? Precisely! Alright, I'm down. What do you want me to do, Skip? You keep watch while I prep a way for us to bust out of here. Okay. I mean... The hall looks clear to me. You know, we might be the only guys in this block. Damn it! I'm out of toothpaste. What can I use? Uh, I think someone's coming, Skipper. <laughs> yeah, you need to get us out of here. All right, all right. Pass me what I need from that bag over there. You got it. Tape, toothbrush, batteries, sponge, lube. What? I said lube, goddammit. All right, relax. Jesus, why do you have an extra large container? I'm a penguin, not a fucking priest. Give me the damn lube. What are you doing with that anyway? I'm busting a out of here. I'm sorry. Did you just make a pipe bomb out of a toothbrush? And lube. Not bad. That was productive. 
Very well, Frog. This is where our temporary alliance ends. Will I ever see you again, Skipper? God, I fucking hope not. Your nakedness offends me. What? But you got- But you guys are naked too- Hey! It's been several weeks in this dark cave. You've been alone, but you are in your element. The harsher the conditions, the better you adapt. You are sexy, you are wet, and you know it. It's just a matter of time before you reach your destination. But suddenly, you stumble upon a mysterious dragon, slumbering in the middle of the cave and you- I attempt to f*** it. You what? The dragon? I attempt to- No, I heard you the first time, Zarbon. Why would you- I don't discriminate. What if the dragon is trying to help you? Oh, it can still help us. After I f*** it. Solid strategy. I set the mood by playing my guitar. Don't entertain this Vegeta. Besides, he has to roll first. <laughs> Natural 20. Oh, come on! <laughs> okay, Zarbon grabs the lube and he screws the dragon. There! Are you happy? Mm, the best three seconds of my life. Three seconds? Impressive. I must know the secrets to your training. Can we get back to the game? Hold on! I'd also like to f the dragon. Roshi! <laughs> Net 20. Fuck! Alright, Roshi also makes sweet love to the dragon. Can we move on? Just wait a damn second! I, Vegeta, the bard of all Saiyans, will also f the dragon. Vegeta, come on, man! <laughs> You fail. Wait! I use my wingman spell on Vegeta to give him plus three advantage. That makes it 21! Give me them dragon cheeks! Fuck it, me too. God damn it, fine! You all have a giant fucking dragon orgy, is that what you guys want? Nice. 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 So, through the use of cybernetically enhanced androids, the Red Ribbon Army plotted to destroy the world? Oh, no, no, no. Take over the world. I try to destroy the world. Right, gotcha, gotcha. Is there a specific reason why? Or did you just decide, you know, fuck everyone? I mean, I didn't choose my purpose. It was given to me by a computer. By a computer? What kind are we talking here? Like a MacBook, perhaps? A perfect being wasn't created by a MacBook. I have some notes here. And it says here you lost to a child after challenging him in a fight to the death. Is this true? That's true, sadly. Well, I'm gonna level with you, man, to be honest. This Red Ribbon Army thing sounds kind of tight, not gonna lie, but I will say this. It's uncommon, unheard of even, to fight children to the death. That kind of stuff doesn't really happen around here. Get me? I mean, I've been looking all day at these reports. I, it says here you android guys were created for the sole purpose of killing a child. Is this the same child? What? Is that fucking Goku? No! No, that's a completely different child. My father's nemesis, actually. Your father? I thought you said you were created by a MacBook. I was created by a supercomputer, not specifically a MacBook. So you weren't created to kill Goku? No, I was. I was, just, you know, during a different time period. It was Goku's child who gave me the issues. Gohan? Exactly. I hate that fucker. I understand where you're coming from, man. See, if I got my ass wrecked by a ten-year-old, I'd be just as upset, if not more. But we all know that wouldn't happen. Oh, please, you wouldn't have lasted ten seconds. In the square ring? Probably not, but if it was the octagon, a different story, my friend. I would have wrecked that kid with a spin kick. No cap. Yeah, I disagree. If it was myself and a ten-year-old Super Saiyan in the middle of that ring, I'm drop-kicking him, no questions asked. I literally tried to blow up the planet, and the kid still won. What the fuck is a drop-kick gonna do? I mean, let's just be honest. Sounds like a skill issue to me. Oh, fuck you. You said it was game night. I did say that. Kermit, what the hell is this? It's a board game, Cell. We're playing Candyland. Okay, so why do these look like painted Monopoly pieces? Rex ate the Candyland pieces thinking it was actual candy. Rex is blue! He's blue. Okay, well, I am leaving. All right, no candy for you then, I guess. I don't fucking care! Rex, get on the races! All right, I call green. Suddenly in the moon for chocolate, eh? Kermit, just roll the fucking dice. What? You don't roll dice, you draw cards. Jesus, have you never played Candyland before? Of course I've played Candyland before. 
Rex's Candy Land Champion! Okay, Mr. Champion, draw your card. Rex dominates all of you! What? I thought you said this was Candyland. This is Candyland. God damn it, I am not in the mood for this. Let me see that. <laughs> Look, just trust me, okay? I have professional experience in this field. Right. What is it? This is a Pokeball. It traps Pokemon to eternal servitude and asserts your dominance over them. Oh, I like the sound of that. I'll take a thousand. You can only carry six. Then I'll take six. Thousand. What? No, you can only carry six! Fight me! Ugh, you wanna take this one? I don't even know how to Pokemon battle. It's easy, all right? Just look, take one of mine. Okay. <laughs> it is true. I have returned, mis amigos. Rex, just Charizard! Rex, you moron! That's a Snorlax! Face, Rex Charizard, you coward! Oh my god, Juan, please, can you just. See, si, senor, say. Oye, oh yeah, amigo! That's super effective! Charizard returns! Rex, choose Mewtwo! Rex, come on, man! Mewtwo, you flamethrower! That's not Mewtwo! Mewtwo, dodge! Right, Black, can you finish this, please? Okay. Damn. That's a fat ass. It's about time you returned. Can you please clean up after yourself? This place is an absolute mess. Well, what are you waiting for? That's not funny. How are we supposed to eliminate all life if you can't even keep a simple apartment clean? Gods deserve a break sometime. Yes, because this is what gods of creation and destruction should be doing. Lounging around in a filthy apartment. I'd rather do more important things than subject myself to manual labor. Right, because stuffing yourself with this muck just screams productivity. By the way, did you hear about the new World Martial Arts Tournament? Yes, but what's the point in entering? We're gods. To show the mortals who's boss? Also, we need the prize money. Rent's overdue. Seriously? What happened to the new job you started? It blew up. It wasn't my fault. Entirely. All right, fine. We'll enter. But first, we need to clean. We can't let our divine status be tarnished by living like slobs. All right, fine, I'll clean. But you're doing the dishes. Fine. But you're taking out the garbage. Fine. What do we do with the body, though? Let's sleep on it. It's not that comfortable, I tried. Well, you... What? Would you like a slice? That's a fat ass. That's what I said. <laughs> what the? You're joking. Come on. Come on, come on! Son of a- Dude, it is like 3 a.m. What are you doing? What? This vending machine stole my money. Why are you messing with the vending machine at 3 a.m.? Why the fuck are you judging me? Do you have another dollar? Kermit, does it look like I have another dollar? You know, Cell, sometimes you can solve your issues without having to blow shit up. See? No harm done. Ah! ah! Master Chief! Just the Spartan I wanted to see. Reporting for duty, sir. Well, Chief, I got a mission for you that's so important 
It's almost ridiculous. My specialty. We've received reports of a dangerous new weapon being developed by the enemy. It's so powerful that it can destroy entire planets. That sounds like a threat we can't ignore, sir. Exactly. So we need you to sneak into the enemy's home planet and steal the plans for this weapon. Consider it done. I'll do whatever it takes to complete the mission. That's the spirit, Master Chief, but there's just one catch. And that is, sir? The enemy's planet is well guarded by an army of evil space chickens. Space chickens, sir? Yeah, yeah, that's right. And they're not just any space chickens, Master Chief. They're highly trained, highly intelligent, and highly dangerous space chickens. How am I supposed to infiltrate the planet with an army of space chickens guarding it? Ah, but that's the challenge, Master Chief. You'll have to use your Spartan skills to sneak past the army of chickens undetected and steal the plans for the superweapon. No offense. This sounds like a suicide mission, sir. Look, I never said protecting the galaxy from evil space chickens was going to be easy. Right. I'm pretty sure that's a duck, sir. Can I count on you, Master Chief? I won't let you down, sir. Great. I knew I could count on you, buddy. And don't worry. I'll be right here rooting for you. Hey, pass me a space coat before you leave. Hold on now. Nice duck. Go back to sleep. Mission accomplished, sir. That's what I like to hear, Chief. You've done this galaxy a great service. I guess you could say those chickens didn't know who they were clucking with. Huh? Huh? Am I right, Chief? Chief? Chief! All right. Thanks again! Oh. Oh shit, that is a duck. I'm just saying. Here we go. On Thanksgiving, we traditionally serve the guests turkey. Yeah, Sel doesn't like turkey. He says it's too dry. So instead, we're having hot dogs. You are all children. What's wrong, Shallot? The strongest can't handle a sandwich. Well, actually, Sel, a hot dog is not a sandwich. It's more like a taco. Okay, I'm sorry. I can't do this. Why are we having Thanksgiving dinner with these fucking randoms? What do you mean, Sel? He's that one popular guy from that one show. <laughs> Boobs! Half of these characters have never had screen time! Who the hell are these people? Well, that guy's an idiot, and that robot's an idiot from the future. You stupid sacks of me! I was a hit on the Cartoon Network! I thought it was Comedy Central. That taco was a little dry. It's not a taco. Did we just witness murder? Nah, he's fine. It's appropriate for his error. Come on, silly! Where's your sense of humor? I'm sorry, is that a rabbit? The one and only, Roger Rabbit! Okay, we get it! You want to kill us! Huh. Well, at least it wasn't you. Ah! Uh, nice dinosaur. Good dinosaur. Fight me! Ah! Hermit, you said we were leaving. We are! In a boat. I'm not taking a boat. Come on, get in the boat. I got us food for the journey. The fuck is that? It's an apple. Would you like some? That is not an apple. I have seen that somewhere before. Come on, let's go. Where did you even get this boat, Kermit? The Naruto universe. The Naruto universe, really? Yeah. Okay, the goat doesn't exactly scream in Naruto universe, Kermit. I'm telling you, Cell, it's straight from the Naruto universe. So is that umbrella. What? What the fuck are you talking about? Kermit! The boat isn't from the Hidden Leaf Village, goddammit! Of course it is! Don't you see this giant headband thingy? <laughs> you fucking bitch! 
<laughs> hey, Kermit, long time no see. Bon, is that you? Where have you been? It's been like 80 episodes. Has it been that long? Nah, around there. Glad to see you again, buddy. Uh, what's with the ice cream truck? Diversifying my portfolio, my green friend. Would you like to try one? Sure, why not? I'll take two, please. Always looking out for sell, huh? No problem. Here you go. Thank you, Bon. I... Uh... The hell is this? Seriously? It's Spider-Man. Bon, I know it's Spider-Man. Did he have a rough day or something? It's limited edition, actually. Bon, this is clearly melting. Uh, yeah. Because that's what ice cream does. Dumbass. Right. And here's the second one. Bon, come on, man. What is this? Dude, it's SpongeBob. You don't know SpongeBob either? I know who he is, Bon. It's obvious you're selling these as limited edition to cover up the fact that they're just melted ice creams. I classify it more as abstract art. It's not art, Bon. You can't just sell melted ice... What the fuck happened to your shirt? Sales increase when I take my shirt off. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's bullshit. Mm. I'll take seven. <laughs> so, how did you afford a submarine? The black market. Don't worry, these babies are safe and totally legit. Why are we down here? Gentlemen, we are on a search for a terrible monster known only to those in legend. I can't pronounce its name, so for today, I'm calling it Carlos. It's not his name. It's Cthulhu. Aren't you a little concerned with this mission? I'm a sea turtle, man. If shit goes wrong, I can swim. Fuck. We're on a mission to save the world, boys. Keep those eyes peeled. Damn it! Something's got us! Eh, uh, Roshi! Hull integrity at 50%! I knew it! He's crushing us! Kermit! I need you to grab the remote controls for the weapons and fight back! Okay, you got it, Roshi! Uh, which one? Isn't it obvious? The fucking Logitech controllers, goddammit! Fire! Fire! Fuck! I think the batteries are dead! My god. It's that one episode. What do you mean, it's that one episode? You know, the one where we dress up for Halloween. Weren't you the same thing last year? Fight me! Okay, it's kinda creepy. Father, it's only for a night. Oh, Frieza, my boy. It is beneath us to participate in such earthly tradition. Besides, you're far from perfect. What the hell do you know about earthly tradition? You're a goddamn turtle! Technically, if it's Halloween, I can be whatever I want. I choose to be a feminist. You're gonna get us canceled, you fuck! Can we just do this one time? One time. One time. Happy Halloween, peasant. Give us your finest candy or be eradicated. This isn't magical at all. Just shut up and get to the next house. You burned my house to the ground! My family's dead! What do I do? I'm gonna you. Fuck you, I'm gonna... All right. What is this strange contraption, and why have we been summoned to this place? Well, I thought you could learn to do laundry. Laundry? What is this, some new training machine? No, this is a device that mortals use to clean clothes. You put them in here, add detergent, press a few buttons, and... What? Can I press it? Um... Sure. Oh! What magic is this? It's like witnessing a divine cleansing ritual. Well, minus the sacrifices. They call it a washing machine. I must admit, the mortals have impressive scientific engineering. With this, we will conquer the laundry, and then eradicate all our- Actually, then it's the dryer. Yeah, we hit the dryer next, then we fold it, put it away, you know how it goes. Then we eradicate all life. A dryer? Fascinating. Can we climb into it? Why? Why not? Zob, 
have on? Yes, my lord. You are dismissed. Come again, sir. Take the day off. Well, and do what? I don't know. Whatever the fuck you want. But, but my lord. But my lord, Zabod, if you don't leave this chamber this instant, it's your ass. Mm. Zabon! Yes, my lord. Zabon? What the hell are you doing here? Oh, hey, guys. I'm just, you know, hanging around. Zabon, you don't just hang around. Yeah, usually you're, you know, masturbating. I was going to say helping Lord Frieza, but yeah. Well, Lord Frieza told me to take the day off. Oh, that's great. So why are you moping around? Well, it's just, it feels out of place. Like all the toys don't fit, you understand, right? In that context, no. But the point of having a day off is to relax, Zarbon, either by yourself or with friends. Well, I guess I just noticed that I don't have many friends. What nonsense! Where are your friends? He's your friend. I'm your friend! I just don't understand. Why would Lord Frieza dismiss me? I don't need a day off. Sometimes we just need to take a little time for ourselves, Zarbon. Look at Cell. He can't always be at the arena filming videos, so he usually comes here to start drunk fights with randoms. Fight me! It's just, I thought I was Lord Frieza's favorite. I've done everything he's asked. I've been loyal. Well, here's some advice from a friend. Never be so loyal that you betray yourself, Zarbon. Hmm. Just try to enjoy yourself, buddy, and do what you do best. Have a good one, pal. Moan if you need me. He has a point. I'm going to do what I do best. Bartender, six bottles of loot, please. Hello, Malcolm. Oh, Professor Wild, thank God. I've, I've been trying to reach you. I'm sorry, Malcolm. I've been a bit tied up. I haven't been able to find any more on Agul, though my resources are a bit limited. Uh, Professor, where the hell are you? Ooh, doing a stretch of five to ten. Apparently the authorities frown on selling math to college students. Yeah, apparently. You need to hang up that computer call. Come over here and kiss me on my hot mouth. I'm feeling romantical. <laughs> well, Malcolm, I suppose I should get going. I'm telling you, Cell, he's not Vegeta. He just knows Kung Fu. Kermit, I am not buying your bullshit! I'm being serious. His hairline triggers me! He's not a Saiyan. He's one of the current leaders of the Mishima Zaibatsu. For now. For now? He and his father, they overthrow each other like every week. So no transformations? Eh. Kermit. Okay, he also may or may not be a demon. Kermit! Hmm. <laughs> huh? Me? Hold on, buddy. You're supposed to fight him. Yeah, I guess he's got other plans. Well, in that case, I surrender. What? Sal, I really don't want to get thrown into a volcano. Okay, now you're being dramatic. I'm really not. It was a joke! It was a joke! It was a joke! He has a short temper. Where is he from again? Tekken. I want to be in Tekken. I mean, you're not really missing out. Tekken's mid anyway. <laughs> Combat. It was a joke! It was a joke! It was a joke! <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I thought this was settled. Oh, this is far from settled. He threw us into a goddamn volcano! <laughs> Hold my strawberry milk, Cell. I'm whipping out the video game moves! Oh! I'm all good! Kermit, what the fuck is that? It's from Street Fighter. Why is it so goddamn slow? You know, I'm not sure, but when it hits, it's gonna hurt! A lot! Nah, shit. I forgot they could start step. You moron. What? I'm used to 2D fighters. Okay, what now? Mmm, what if I do it again? Why would you do it again? Hadouken! Kermit. Don't worry, Cell. I put max power into that one. Yeah, never mind. I see the problem. 
<laughs> you must think you're so cool with your stupid hairline and your rock hard abs. Hi ya! Huh. I think I broke my wrist. Do <laughs> that! You know, on second thought, I think I prefer the volcano. <laughs> Then I have to thank you, Charlotte with an E. For you see, I, all for one, have thought of an even more devastating, unforgivable plan! I'll absorb your power next, and then I'll use it to finally destroy what's left of this current universe! Alright. Do it, pussy. No balls. Yeah, so we ran out of budget. We we ran out of budget. Basically, yeah. So what what the fuck? What about the ending? Uh Well, All for One gets wrecked by Shallot's fusion, then he's surrounded by copious amounts of big tittied anime bitches, and we'd have a big send-off with asses and tits all over the screen. Jesus, we were about to get to the best part. I know. I know. Fucking shame. How much we got left? Uh, three dollars. Fuck it. We're bringing back super friends. <laughs>